Welcome to the Elevator World News Podcast. Two books from New York Times best-selling author Judith Dupre are available in our online bookstore. Skyscrapers, which is a celebration of the world's best supertalls, and One World Trade Center, a behind-the-scenes look at this iconic building. Skyscrapers and One World Trade Center can be purchased separately or together as a set. Both contain visually stunning photos. For more information and to order, visit elevatorbooks.com by clicking on the links in the show notes. This is your daily industry news update for March 31st, 2017. In today's news, Mumbai gets a big contract for Chal High Rises. Singapore authorities are fighting to prevent elderly escalator accidents. A man is seriously injured in an escalator fall in the UK, and we have corrected information on Dubai's The Tower. The buildings and factories business of Larson and Tubro, or L&T Construction, has won what the Economic Times calls a key design and build order, valued at more than 448 million US dollars, to redevelop Mumbai's century-old Bombay Development Division Charles at Worley for the Maharashtra Housing and Area Development Authority. l t stated it is the largest residential contract it has ever been awarded. The work comprises complete design and construction of 20 residential towers with 24 floors plus 3 basement levels, construction of 4 high-rise towers with 73 floors and 3 basement levels, and construction of 1 commercial development with 22 floors and 3 basement levels. On March 28th, Singapore's Land Transport Authority, or LTA, initiated a series of public education activities to encourage the elderly to take elevators instead of escalators. The Straits Times reported that the intention is to reduce the risk of them getting hurt while using escalators at MRT stations. Among other initiatives, volunteers dispersed souvenirs to elderly commuters to remind them to use elevators instead. They consisted of packs of tissues and an easy link card holder with the message, quote, Seniors, come get a lift. Make it a safer trip, printed in all four national languages. MRT has seen a high rate of escalator incidents among seniors, noting that approximately 70% of escalator-related incidents in recent years have involved passengers above 60 years old. A man in his 50s suffered what Kent Online called, quote, serious facial injuries, end quote, after falling down an escalator in a Maidstone, UK shopping center on March 27th. He was flown to King's College Hospital in London for further treatment after being found unconscious. It was surmised that he fell over a balustrade while traveling upward. Foul play was not suspected. Some details of, quote, update on Creek Harbor, now the tower, end quote, were incorrect. First, the main elevator contractor is not yet announced, and the vertical transportation package tender documents have yet to be released. Second, Completion and soft opening of the tower are planned for 2020. For more industry-related information, visit elevatorworld.com and be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel for daily news, EW product videos, and more.